in the UK, PET bottles are an established pack type, but also a strong feature of FMCG packaging performance uh, this year. Its unit consumption is meant to grow by 3%, which compares with 1% on average for total packaging. PET's success uh, largely relates to its ability to offer that added convenience to the end consumer. We have the example of carbonates, the highest volume category for PT in 2012. There, PT bottles have been able to take shares of metal beverage cans. Because convenience matters more and more to the British consumer, more than the unit price for this type of product, in fact. And their PT offers various sizes and also reclosability. Reclosability was also a good card to play for PET in 2011 and 2012. Uh, following the 60 milliliter shot sizes uh, released by a few brands in energy drinks, Red Bull also launched a 330 milliliter version to complement its standard 250 mil can. And that's for easier on the go consumption. In fact, sports and energy drinks in the UK is the highest contributor to absolute unit growth for PT, and it shows equally bright prospects to 2016. There are other areas where PT is expected to um, experience dynamic growth, and opportunities go beyond beverages, and it's not always all about bottles. PT jars in canned beans is probably a good example. Uh, we have brand Heinz leading brands in the UK uh, that started this by launching a one kilo PT jar for its beans that's highly visible on the shelf and it's also positioned as a fridge pack so it's easily stored in the fridge and reclosable. And in 2012 more brands and private labels followed through so we have Branston and also Asda that released their own version of the pack type. So by 2016, we can also expect PET as a material to be utilized as a practical solution in alcoholic drinks, especially in wine. So here, the use of PET is largely confined to an outdoor and seasonal type of consumption, but also large events. So we have the example of the Olympic Games that took, uh, took place uh, here in London over the summer. The, the official wines were released in PET bottles. Having said that, penetration of alcoholic drinks uh, will remain a tough bottle for PT. PT is still uh, largely perceived as somewhat lacking compatibility with alcoholic drink products when compared with glass. <laughs>